Welcome back. Communities in Ohio are under a mandatory evacuation order after this major freight train derailment. Around 50 cars, some carrying hazardous material, derailed, causing a massive fire. Jessica Gway reports. We are at a uh, risk now of a catastrophic failure of that container. A drastic change in temperature inside one of the toppled rail cars prompted that emergency warning late last night. This catastrophic failure will, if it occurs, it will produce hydrogen chloride and phosgene gas into the atmosphere. We need you to leave now. Since Friday, the flames continue to burn out of control from the heap of rail cars tossed across and on top of each other. I just could not fathom all the fire. About half of the 100 cars from this freight train traveling from Madison, Illinois to Conway, Pennsylvania derailed Friday, creating this massive blaze. I went outside on the porch and looked and you see flames shooting about 20 feet in the air. The cause of the crash is still under investigation, but federal investigators with the NTSB say a preliminary review says two videos show a mechanical issue with the rail car axle. We are working to identify which rail car experienced the potential mechanical issue for further examination. Authorities say at least 20 of those cars were carrying hazardous chemicals. So far, East Palestine's mayor says the town's air and water quality are safe and the state's environmental agency would remove any contaminants from nearby streams. But the lingering pungent smell in the air are giving some concern. Is it safe for everybody to go back home? Is it safe to be anywhere within the blocked off area? In East Palestine, Jessica Gway, CBS News Pittsburgh. The winter